And this is the Lilienthal and Company flask. It's uh, it's not a pint. I guess they call it a pint, or it's kind of in between what looks like a pint, maybe a pint and a half. That worms her size. Um, but it's a nice condition. Uh, somebody asked me why we give it a nine. And I look at a nine as being just a nice bottle, having some wear, some few scratches. You know, you can kind of see um, just not being cleaned and having that pristine sort of look to it. It's a very old bottle, and it's got a nice drip around the top. We are told there's like four of these known. It's pretty hard to uh, verify that, but it sounds about right. We don't see many of these at all. See them in amber, that's for sure. But we're just trying to get a better idea on some of these because we didn't do the videos this time around. We just did not have the time. But uh, nice example, as we say, in good condition, really pretty good for its age, and a wonderful color.